Let's go. You were grooming yourself in the bathroom Zoe. when suddenly Liam re reveals himself in your sack. Oh, what the what? fuck, Liam? What the no. frick? I literally never interacted with him. How long has he been there? Don't vampires need to be invited to houses or something? You have something but He showed up at your house? <laughs> I, I literally yes. never was in your house! Uh, so Susie, crazy. I noticed you, you asked the other day a buyer of my collection of slightly used vintage Motocap 6 books. What? what the fuck? Is. Is that what those were? <laughs> like, admiring was a strong word before, but now. I'm sure you that I have many search of bays and companies so that the average civilian could never hope to take on, but she had a great talent. This guy is off. lonely. <laughs> Trading yeah, insect I, legs. Trading insect legs? Bottling peak toxic waste to burn into fine wines. Generally oh. being part of DIM culture. What's that? <laughs> Do I not like it? Truly one of the greatest joys of the park. You gotta create a romance. It's getting to share your obscure hobbies and gonna fuck off. I hate you. You never talked to Susie yeah. before. Yeah, why is he just so He's talking to you about Isla. <laughs> <laughs> That's what this is. Oh. Oh. Wait, 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 wait a second. So my character is a zombie. Susie's character is a zombie. Is well, this Susie's like... is a Frankenstein monster. Oh, okay, all right. Yeah. Okay. Which is basically a zombie, and but with yeah. other more parts. <laughs> oh god. Is this a zombie with extra steps? <laughs> yeah. I mean, I just made more Susie's like last night. <laughs> but tell me, what are, what are her hobbies? Will she have some great knowledge to share with me? Don't mess this up for me. Sure, if you like, bingo. No. <laughs> <laughs> did you know? Did, did you not know? I was the founder and head editor of Exotic Aquatics, the guide to breeding rare just pick fish. Pick whatever you want. <laughs> Dude, that one sounds like smarts. The top one. Yeah, and I was pretty damn smart. I'm pretty smart. Yeah, that first one sounds like something yeah. weird, like so first one. How did hey. that? Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Exotic to aqu exotic aquatics. Why I read that every month? <laughs> like it's not the heart with Bri with Brian, and I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> but it was for him. it was a heart towards me from him. I don't know. <laughs> what the fuck? I got for my prize turquoise tang Trixie throughout a tunnel maze on the based on those teachings. I had no idea that it was Isla who was responsible for that. Yeah, this was this is Isla. <laughs> totally me. Truly, I cannot wait to hear more about her exotic aquatic prowess. Isla's a CEO and she didn't know it till this moment. <laughs> Perhaps a problem. Wait, is he gonna ask me? Wrong? Like at this point? <laughs> Man, you Man. sure hope that Isla knows this shit about fists. <laughs> you say so many ridiculous things a day. You can <laughs> you cannot for the life of you keep track which are true and which are lies. It'll be keeping your fingers and <laughs> and fins crossed for her. Creativity. You get in creativity. This was such a weird thing. What the heck? <laughs> you just showed up in your shower to ask you about me. Because it was also in a shower. <laughs> Susie was probably taking a shower. And he was suddenly <laughs> yeah, there. I was like, hey, can you tell me how to get with Isla? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's so weird. Everyone choose oh. a movie. Okay. Ready player Princess one. Bride. Movie. Um, Promare. Okay. I don't know what that is, but okay. It's Barbie Fairy Topia Mermania. That's a great choice. <laughs> I love what you're choosing. Uh, oh, I chose Ready Player One. Okay. The Demon Slayer movie. How? Okay. Oh. Okay, yeah. Mine's okay, easy. So can you allow me to, to attempt to explain Promare since you don't know it? Yeah, okay. Okay, so Promare takes place. It's like cyberpunk. So already, old people are like cyberpunk, huh? Um, and then it's like mech, you know, like like um, uh, like Gundam, like Gundam. We've got like people in giant mechs and they're fighting stuff. I'm pretty sure they use the word Gundam. I'm pretty sure you're saying the word Gundam with everyone. Yeah. Um, and, 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 and
Okay, who's like, second? To take the four. <laughs> I said the Demon Slayer movie, and the Demon Slayer movie is basically, you know, when me and Isla were talking about the sword colors? Yeah. And it was really fucking complicated. Do you really think I'm going to be able to explain that shit to an old person? Okay, Princess Bride, it's fucking easy to explain to anyone, so. Yeah. I feel like I everyone knows that. I like the Princess Bride. I watched it when the I was Princess Bride is so good. I watched it yeah. last I love night. Princesses. Oh, let's you, go. I watched it last oh, night. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> It'd take me to... Wait, can you check the stats, uh, please? Library. No, fuck library. you, my god. <laughs> 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 okay, what? The thing is, I'm not even sure if Susie has the <gasps> stats to get... I'm not even sure if Susie has the stats to get with Zoe. It... Do I have to have certain stats? Yeah. It but might she... be charm. <laughs> I'm just saying. If it's... Oh no! I was hoping it was creativity, because you know. Yeah, well, it's pick. multiple. Creativity is probably the higher one. I'm not sure what the other oh. one is. Uh, I've read a whole half page of nonfiction book. I feel like my brain is gonna explode. I hate studying. Ah, gross! No one has even made a since this match text textbook. <laughs> well, if you think of the greater than symbol, then maybe. Oh. Uh. <laughs> The greatest I lesson, do like books, trip. though. They can take you anywhere in the world. So when you pee on them, it's like you're marking <laughs> your territory across the planet. Damn it, Scott. <laughs> that explains the wavy, crispy texture and pugnant odor of a lot of your used textbooks. You wonder if it's worth oh. trying to correct his error. Dimitri! That's right. What? It is oh. I, Dimitri. Who is the Would you ever infiltrate the mock side? 
That's why God invented fake name tags, baby! Next time, you won't be so lucky. Curses. Once again, promising recruits are stolen from my very grasp by the temptation of the mock side. Why has this happened more than once? <laughs> what? Why has that happened more than one time? Dimitri, you suck. Dimitri vanishes to post a couple of negative reviews of the mark side on wealth. <laughs> Honestly, you're a bad member of the dark side if you got Mark if Mark has <laughs> twice. Doesn't matter. Mark side rules and Scott whoops everyone asses at Monopoly. That's weird. You're getting too Damn, fun and Scott's one money. Good at Monopoly, Let's do the this. Hell? <laughs> All right, all right, want all right go... negative one creativity. What you doing? I'm going to get some charm, please. Ah, yes. I was I just realized you have because if I get more charm, I because I have uh, money over eight, um, and if I just get my charm over uh, you, 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 you are googling. You are googling. <laughs> I'm Is googling this... what I have from what, with what I have fucking left, Void. <laughs> You don't have mercy. No mercy. <laughs> Next game, you find yourself stuck on team with Calculester, A, Miranda, A, and Liam. So Three mean. great friends of Hot Bot, but zero. Two. Liam's not in person. Zero dodgeball Madness skills. Detected. Correction. Aggravate team dodgeball skill index. Negative 5.6. Fine, I'll just show myself out then. Calculester? You may not be very good at dodgeball, but we've got something even better on our side. Me! You, you would. I, I do not think you're good at all in dodgeball. Princess! The other team doesn't even have a lowly discount. Victory is ours by divine right! Well, yeah, I made you when I was in jail, Miranda, and he was, I didn't get out. <laughs> Whatever, we're obviously the charismatic underdogs in this situation. The other team might win the game, but we'll get the moral victory. The other team is like Damien, Scott, and <laughs> just, you're fucked. <laughs> Negative. <laughs> the opposing team is a group of scrappy youths from the wrong side of the tracks. They are roughly 86 more symp sympathetic than we. We have royalty. We're not scrappy underdogs. According to ah, my calculations, okay. there's no logical way for us to achieve victory, moral or otherwise. Vanderbilts don't lose? Not at, at international intrigue? And not at dodgeball? We'll simply have to find a way of winning. Beyond logic! Now, who among us is the most illogical? Oh, of course, Silver. What shall we do? <laughs> Silver has 23 smarts. Um. And, and, and less than zero creativity. We've all... so, Silver is somehow anti-creative. Just. I'm creative. I don't know. Uh, the top one seems like it might be creativity, so go to the bottom. I've been- we've been training for this our whole lives without knowing it. Our day-to-day -day activities are actually dead. That might be charms. That's smarts. Oh. Nice. You, oh, no. you need to pick that one. Yes, of course. The peasants in my fife done attempt to hurl projectiles at me every day as I enter my diamond carriage. And you dodge them all, make you an incredible dodgeball player after all. Oh. I have my servants standing in the way so that the projectiles hit them instead. And there's no reason I can't do that here as well. <laughs> there are plenty of reasons, such as the rules of dodgeball, but nobody wants to argue with Miranda's armed guards, so there you go. Okay, we got protection now, but how are we supposed to fight back? All I can do is drink blood and have objectively correct opinions now about art. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah, it, Liam. Fucking die. Go up to the <laughs> other. Commit murder. Go Bite their necks. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Is that a pretty 
opinions about art. I thought this day would never come. I'm finally useful, guys. What? Do we to dodge our throws? Drink their blood. Fine too, I guess. What about you, Calculus? So what everyday action will you use to aid us? I oh. will shoot hornets out of my chest. It is very distracting. What? Fuck did you get a hornet? How do I what? The combination of military force, vampirism, and swarms of stinging insects, you turn the dodgeball game into a complete slaughter. Just as the way it was meant to be. You gain two boldness and plus one fun. I think you literally murdered the competition. Um, sure. Again. <laughs> uh, Alright. Um Darn. Okay. Um <clears throat> Alright, where are you going? Uh da -da -da. Go like class, auditorium, outdoors. And you have no money, but there I is no the money. gift. Um, There's technically the gift that keeps on giving. It would still be there. I'm pretty sure, but. All right. Um, where where do you go to get oh, auditorium? Creative. Yeah. Yeah, uh, you got a bunch of roses and stuff. True creativity. You're able to rehearse the scene where Scott falls into the forest, Please. and only Damien and Liam are around to hear him when Dahlia comes storming in. This is a takeover! Ah, uh, Damien, I see that your wretched cowardice is so abated, you are finally outfitted for battle! <laughs> Let us settle our claims to the eighth circle of hell now with Liam and this tree as our witnesses! A tree! <laughs> hey! I'm not a tree! I'm Scott! You might not have noticed because I'm doing such a good job of being a tree. <laughs> yeah, you're a good boy. He's doing his best. Indeed you are, and such a strong tree at that. Join me, Scott, in my conquest for the Eighth Circle. I can use a lieutenant who is also a tree. You could. I just want to go record as saying that I do not support any of this. <laughs> fuck, fuck off, pacifist. This is a war. In the game. No one cares. <laughs> uh, Did right, you see Dahlia's you. line? Uh, yeah. Straight uh, up said nobody cares. Liam. I don't need to support it. Uh, wait, what? I don't need to support on the battlefield. My scourge is verbal concubine. No! Concubine! <laughs> She's winking! She's winking! No, no, no. Wink! No! <sighs> I'm the only one at school who takes theater seriously. We are in the middle of a scene. Yes, the scene of the crime. The crime I'm about to do to you. That crime is murder. Okay, first of all, murder isn't a crime. <laughs> Second of all, we're not doing any of it right now. Why are you outfitted for battle? <clears throat> this is a costume. A real battle armor. It's just 700 knives tied together with barbed wire. That's so Why? Metal. A likely it's, story, face me, coward. It is quite literally metal. Uh, all this drama is interfering with your theatrical production. You need to get Dahlia out of here, but how? Dahlia, that isn't the real Damien. This real Damien was inside you all along. Or, if you want Damien, you're gonna have to go through me and this army of pissed off Rottweilers. Oh, Which dang one? It. Oh, I don't know. Uh, I'll go with the bottom Gary, one. Gary, man. <gasps> Ah, creative. Uh -huh. <laughs> what? Damien, is this true? No. <laughs> Why am I asking you? You're not Damien, just a clever fist for smile. For too long have I had a feeling deep inside that something was wrong. This is not over. Oh. No, no, this feeling it was. It was Damien! You're you're real you're really going for this, aren't you? Silence, doppelganger. I'm off to go poop out the real Damien so I can fight him. <laughs> you sure are a character, huh? Yeah, Sorry, fuck you. <laughs> Yo, we why? Why? Why, why, why does she bathroom? have a thing for him? I don't <laughs> understand. But wait, if if Damien's inside Dahlia. And Dahlia's gone. Who are you? 
I'm Damien. I was doing something called lying. <laughs> I've heard of lying before, but I have no idea how it works. Tell me more. You got rid of Dahlia, but you inadvertently gave Damien a good opportunity to explain Scott how to act. Oh, damn. Oh. You're smart and creative. All right. Uh, I'm just gonna start a race. Are you fucking dabbing, Boyd? Yes, I am hip hoppity scoppiting. <laughs> you, you spot Juan. Oh, hey, Juan, how's it going? Juan! He's, he's worried that people Probably. only call him that, and that's the only thing he's defined by. I just, but we just tell him. There's around 30, 23 different Juans. Like, Jesus, man. Never forget all those crazy things we did back in Monster Middle School. <laughs> I am fun as hell. You notice Liam? Oh no, and Polly <laughs> gather around calculus. Liam is just like going around to everybody. <laughs> He's a creep. He he showed up at Susie Sour. I'm, I'm I am I am you, justified. You cannot escape him. <laughs> I'm justified in not liking him. He's a creep. Yeah. Gathered around calculus, they're watching expectantly from the look of her face is not going well. Do my so do. <laughs> it's do me so it's, it's, mo, it's you know do re mi fa so la so so do ti sa li do or how is my music do friends? Are you enjoying it? Yes, we're enjoying it, calculus. So Liam, shut the fuck up. I don't enjoy music I experience. I don't enjoy music I experience. Oh, <laughs> 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 but no, I, your oh, music is kind that. of bad. Sorry, no, Calculus, you're doing your best. You're doing your best, okay? You got this. I am trying my hardest. Why is success so difficult to achieve? Music Aww. is so simple. It is merely mathematics. <laughs> Oh, no. oh god. Oh no. I'm sorry, what did you just say? <laughs> did you just say something's logical in front of Liam? <laughs> I'm trying my very hardest. Why is... No, no, I heard you. That was a rhetorical question. I meant to demonstrate my incur... Incredulity. Incredulity. Yay! Yeah, dude, music is more than just some lame math. It's about rhythm and groove and having a killer bass line to help the ecstasy kick in. Yeah. <laughs> No, no, Polly, you have to focus on sensation. Good music should give you the same feeling as a milky and the rain. So, kind of wet? Yeah. <laughs> oh. And wondering why it's raining? Uh, why October specifically? And kind of cold and just like bad. And, and kind of scared <laughs> of what the goat's about to do? I mean, that's not a good feeling. And in in instructions incomprehensible. Please provide a foolproof formula for the production of flawless music. Well, he's too high to provide a foolproof formula for anything except maybe LSD. And Liam thinks formulas are for fascists. Oh. Looks like it's up to you to make a suggestion. Music is all about randomness. Oh no. Upload a virus into Calculester! I'm not a gonna upload a virus into Calculester. Yeah, do it, do it, do it. It's do like drugs! Do, do, do it, do it, do it. I'm pretty sure it's bold. Uh, music is about waiting as long as possible to drop the bass. I see. It's a formula I can borrow. Commencing slow buildup. <laughs> oh man, this is gonna be so <laughs> Normally, I remember music constructed according to a formula, yeah. but suffering through anticipation is my second biggest <laughs> What? Take notes, Isla. <laughs> One hour later. <laughs> Any second now? Five hours Be later. Even more. Polly, let's go home. I think Calculus was caught in some kind of loop. Yeah, okay. Do you guys want to go get drunk? Yeah, why not? Eight hours later at the club. Calculus is still in the schoolyard making loud drum noises. Well, there's any purpose to life at all. Oh. Three more hours. Two balls of scots. 
and one existential conversation later. <laughs> and that's why I think of death is more of like a reward, you know? Well, Polly, I didn't know you had such spiritual depths. Maybe we should. <laughs> Awesome, Boo. Yeah, he dropped it. He dropped it. This entire evening was in reality part of Calculus's song. This is the most meta musical experience possible. You I all have Liam to go to get brain it. surgery okay. to pr to repair just how blown your brains are. Calculus begins working on a decade-long dubstep buildup. Gain two creativity in one spot. Wait, hearts. all of us, even Polly? Polly has to go get brain surgery somehow. I don't know how. Historical no figure. Just... Historical figure, Alexander Hamilton. Figure. <laughs> oh. Um, Julius um... Caesar. Stalin. Oh. <laughs> Susie, what was oh, yours? I gotta think of a good one now. Oh, I gotta think of a good one. George uh -huh. Washington. What was the first thing that came to mind, Michael Jackson? I mean, that is a- I mean, that is a historical figure. I mean... I mean, he is a historical figure. And he's is it dead. Michael Jackson, Jackson and Demon Jackson, Slayer? Let's go, MJ. Alright. What? Picture this, five MJ. years ago, this historical figure figures time travel to our time. And now they live in present time. Now only one of them can remain here. And who stays is decided through a series of Alive when Pokemon was a thing. And he knows what to do. Pokemon battles. Pokemon okay. battles. Okay, Stalin wouldn't know what the fuck's going on. Uh Hamilton would probably see and some po sort of strategy. Jay would know what to do. Well Julius and Caesar is a what Roman to do. He, general. He was around when Pokemon was a thing. Uh, honestly, I think Julius Caesar would be around when Pokemon was <laughs> a thing. Yeah. <laughs> he might he might. <laughs> Hamilton will might pick it I, up pretty quickly. I, I think I think I think uh I think Hamilton might actually win and then yeah, Mike Hamilton. Jackson might be a close second. And then Julius oh, yeah, Caesar so. would have just quit. He was like alive. He was alive, but <laughs> he was he has the, the upper hand, is, he already I don't understands. Think, like, I don't you know. think Michael Jackson has as much tactical experience. Yeah, oh, but he doesn't have, have to have it explained to him. Well just because that he was born in that time, time doesn't mean that he so he, he like the tactics and such. Yeah, I, I feel like Hamilton would like grasp it quickly. Quickly. Like, no, okay, like, here's the thing though. Michael Jackson was a big fan of video games. Was okay, he? Okay then. Yeah, he oh, was. Okay. He literally composed music for Sonic okay. games before. Okay, oh, right. I'm like, saying Michael big, Jackson then. Yeah, and he then composed like... music for Sonic. He was a big fan of video games. And he then been able to I'd pick say it up like I think that. Hamilton might be able to outsmart Stalin. <laughs> and then, and then I. Think Stalin. Yeah, I think yes. Yeah, Stalin made some. And then Caesar would just refuse to do anything. <laughs>